Now, you are going to now pray for the spirit of humility for what you are about to receive. Are you listening to me? Yes, sir. Now, humility requires, a, there are five ingredients that makes up humility. One is called meekness. Two is called obedience to God. The third ingredient is respect for man. Because you are wealthy doesn't mean you start disrespecting anybody. Some people have money. You can't, they, if they talk to you, yeah, you will use your face to scrub, scrub the floor. Respect to man. Submissiveness to authority that was there for you when you were nothing. And living a life of modesty even when you can afford everything. Modesty. You can have money and still be modest. Not money and become crazy. Before I became a pastor, you will never say anything about my personal life online. She will tell you. I can count how many people in my lifetime has come to my house. Even despite being a pastor. The only time people started coming to my house was when I became a pastor. I had to stop it. Because my house, I, I love my peace. You enter my house, you should, it's, a, it's a haven. Modesty, some of you, some, pe some people, even in your, if God is to open your brain right now, everything you have put in your head to do with money, you want to tattoo your head to your anus, to your leg, everything tattoo. You want to, you want to, you, you, if God allow one, not even one million, one thousand US to touch you, you will go to Turkey to get chopped up like a Turkey. You want to do things that, I'm not saying that it's taking care of yourself, but that is why you abuse the body so that you can fill a void that cannot be filled because of money. Lord, I ask for the spirit of humility and let these five, in, these five ingredients that have been mentioned, let them be found in me. Amen. Modesty, obedience to God, respect for man, meekness, submissiveness. Someone say, Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father. As I begin to pray. As I begin to pray. Lord, I ask for humility tonight. Lord, I ask for humility tonight. I cry for humility tonight. I cry for humility tonight. Oh Lord, oh Lord, that no matter how high you lift me, that no matter how high you lift me, the higher I go, the, I go, the more humble I become. Humble I, become. I become modest. I become, I become meek. I become Respect for others, submissive to authority in the name of Jesus. Lift your voice and pray for one more minute. Please open your mouth and pray. It's, you are entering now into a covenant with your mouth with God. You are entering into a covenant now with God. You are entering into a covenant with God. Please pray, pray, pray. Lord, the higher you lift me, Lord, the meek I become, the meek I become. I become more obedient to oh God, respecting myself and others, oh God. Submissiveness to the same authority that was there for me when I was nothing. Living a life of modesty on all sides, in all ways, in all form of mannerism. Modesty, oh God. Modesty, oh God. Lift your voice and pray. Lift your voice and pray. Lift your voice and pray. Ten more seconds, ten more seconds, ten more seconds. In the name of Jesus. Amen. And the last prayer before I release the covenant word.